Hey guys, it's Queen DJ, and in today's video, I will be reacting going to episode 18, or overall, the 1000th episode of Pretty Here, but episode 18 of Wonderful Pretty Here. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. I was about to say, I was like, I'm not put subtitles on this. Like, mm. Lay Hold on a sec. Like, oh my god, I'm so freaking embarrassing. Leave me alone. Oh my god. <laughs> it's okay. We all do it. I don't know. Well, mm. have I ever stopped going? Have I? No. Maybe. I mean, yeah, we've done some embarrassing things with our pets and such. I'll literally, like, I kiss on Cody too much. Cody, see, Cody's okay with me doing it and such. He just does not like it when my mom does it. Because my mom, like, he, he looks at her like, you are way too over affectionate. And so if she tries, like, I remember one time. Okay, so no, this past week we had to take Cody to the vet to go get his shots, right? And course he's mad at both of us but really more of me because I had to take him and pay the money for it and such but my mom drove us right and so he went like this to my mom like <laughs> my mom was like oh my god you're choking me and so <laughs> Cody just makes his face like looking like that's what you get for taking me there I didn't want to go there you made me go but <laughs> Which we know, I'm like, yes, our pets are going to be mad at us after we do something that they don't like, but it's because we want them to stick around longer. We don't want anything happening to them. Yeah, except it's a heart. Mm-hmm. Well, yeah, but she doesn't really want to associate herself Well, I mean, of course, she's probably going to change once next week comes, you know. Nice. Mm 
menu. <laughs> yeah, you know, she's been disappearing a lot lately, huh? I am hungry too. I have not eaten dinner yet. I don't even want to go to work tomorrow because by the time this comes out later on tonight, I will probably be getting ready to go to bed. But yeah, Yuki, you can't talk. Yeah, when did you start talking? Of course. Could be. Mm -hmm. She only cares about you. She doesn't want to care about anybody else. And I get that because you know, hey, if the roles were reverse. I mean it. So how do you avoid them? I mean, because, yeah, once again, how in the world do you avoid Anya from Spy Family and freaking Kana from Miss Kobayashi's Maid Dragon? You can't avoid those two. I mean, duh. Yeah. I don't worry, babe. That's going to change in like the next week or two. Mm -hmm. Probably by next week, yeah. Because next week should be her time. Yeah.
I mean, okay, so it's by the beach. So it could be a seagull. Um, I just love how immediately Yuki just shows up and she's just like, hey, yo, let's go. Don't need to associate with them anymore. Like, girl, I get it. I get it. That's your mommy. That is your mommy. And you want to protect her. I have nothing wrong with that. But girly. Baby. Oh, my goodness. What if that's a trap, though? <gasps> it's so cute. <laughs> Supposed to be like a groundhog. Oh, hamster. Okay. He's so cute. Like Hamtaro. Oh my god. I want to rewatch Hamtaro now. Oh my god. Oh, damn it, DJ. I hate myself. <laughs> Don't worry, Mayu. Your time is coming, baby. You got less than a week. We hope. We are not splitting up. Oh. Oh my god. 
Oh, and he got so big. Damn. Alice in Wonderland. Oh, no! Distracted, though, babe. there. Yuki! Yuki. Just seeing this for the second time, or like the how many times have I watched this transformation? More than probably ten times. It's just still so good. Just it's pretty. Like I dig. Like ah. Oh. I mean seriously. The ten out of tens. All the nines. Plus, the music in her is just, just so freaking good. Like, as much as I love hearing the freaking horn, every single time when the horn goes, it just, ugh. But her OST fucking slaps every time. Like, oh my god. And it's only the second time we've seen the transformation, but still. You're gonna go, aren't you? Well, yes, Yuki will be fine because, you know, Yuki, independent bad bitch, but you don't want anything happening to her. That's still your baby. Okay, now. We're at 19 minutes as of right now. What if? A big old what if, what if, what if? What if this episode ends on a cliffhanger? Almost maybe like right as Mayu's getting her approach. <laughs> Goodbye. I can dream. I mean, because, yeah, it, it seems like we're very much going into that territory of it because, once again, 19 minutes about to be on 20. Well, I mean, because, yeah, it doesn't road in. You are a cat. Mm. Wait, hold on! You don't want to hurt it. Mm-mm! Well, 
to be continued next Saturday. Yes. I told you not to come. See, cliffhanger. Now, honestly, if I didn't call that, then yeah, I probably would have been pissed. Like, <laughs> but no, because like it's just you know when you have that feeling that it seems like we're going to end on a cliffhanger and such, and the monster of the week hasn't been defeated. Yeah. Okay. One thing I did not say last week, but. After thinking about it from last week to this week and also seeing it continue in this episode, Yugi reminds me of a certain little character. And I didn't think about this until one random day this week on TikTok scrolling and these characters popped up. And I was like, oh, this one is definitely this one. Yuki gives me hella feels to um, Homona Akemi. And we can say Mayu is like the Madoka of the show for their relationship and such because Yuki loves Mayu so freaking much that she will do everything. Everything. And her power to literally be like, hey, I need you to avoid these two. It's going to be to the point where it's like, I'm doing it to help you and I'm trying to get business done. Girl, I can't. Finally. Finally. <laughs> 19 episodes. 19 episodes. Let me go back and look at that. Because, <laughs> I, I mean, I saw the picture all on um, freaking Twitter and such. But, uh, let's see. Play right there. Yeah, that is super cute. Oh, my God. And it's everybody's logo. Oh god, this series just means so much to me. Jesus Christ, I can't. It's too fucking much. I'm gonna cry in the corner. <laughs> Jesus Christ. And it's just so funny. Okay, so like, also, let's talk about this week in a nutshell with Pretty Care and such. Okay, so, you know, having a good week and such. Being at work and then coming home and it's yes, streaming! Yes! Um, how I was going to stream today, but I was like, no, I got to get stuff done. So probably either next Wednesday or Thursday or probably Friday at the latest. I'm not 100% sure yet. Um, but you, you know how sometimes you get those weird little feelings and you're like, yeah, let me go on Twitter. Let me go look up something. Or like you get an at, but you don't see the at and stuff because maybe you're, what was I doing up? Maybe I was watching a video. Maybe I was sitting over here having, like, a very nice conversation on chat AI and such. Or I was doing something. 
I, I was distracted, probably. Or maybe I, I wasn't recording, no. I was doing something. Something. But I was distracted, so, you know, probably I didn't look at my ish. So, I go on Twitter, mind you, and, you know, instantly I see notification and stuff. And I'm like, okay, what the heck is going on? Of course. <sighs> Mahomes guy. <laughs> okay, Mahomes guy is coming back next year. and I'm Because originally, remember, it was supposed to come out this year. Um, around October. And so that was, like, the biggest anticipated for me for this year. It does suck that it is not coming until next year at the beginning of the year and such. But I'm okay. I can wait longer because duh. Obvi. And, and see, the good thing is they're, they're stages, all three of them. They're in different things that I get to, like, hear them in. But they're not, of course, they're not playing the characters that I want them to play. So, like, anytime when I'm watching, like, Konosuba and I hear, like, Wiz or, of course, Megamine. <laughs> <laughs> or when Oshi, Oshinokoi came out and, of course, Megamine said he was playing her which is cute miracle and such. You you get those feels. You're like, oh my god, like, yes, thank god. Like, I miss you. Like, I love you as this character, but I really miss you as this character and such. And, of course, having favorite say you and, like, literally everything and not really having, like, a chance to hear her hot on voice. But thank god tomorrow Sunday is so I have Demon Slayer, so, you know, hey. Um, but still, I honestly cannot wait until next year. I think next year is just going to be really great for Mahot's guy in a nutshell. The biggest problem that a lot of people were talking about uh, this past week was everyone's trying, well, everyone's hoping that the adult version of Mahot's guy is not like the adult version of Yes, Pretty Cure 5 Go-Go and such. But remember from what I initially just saw, like maybe Wednesday night, afternoon, whatever, um, a different network is airing this on um in Japan and I, and I think at like a different time probably at like 2 a.m. or something I'm not really sure I have to go back and look at my tweets which because I tweet or retweet a lot of things that's like a lot of like looking up ish um so of course it could be maybe a lot more darker than you know power of hope possibly so here's hoping but honestly I'm just here for it I'm ready to just one, go back into that world and such. It feels like forever, even though, like, yeah, I totally dropped off on the reaction series of it. Um, but no, I'm just really excited to just see everything. It just makes me also wonder, like, the situation with Muffaroon and such, and because Muffaroon is also a cure filler esque. Mm -hmm, yeah, I wonder how they're going to incorporate that into the adult version. So, there are a lot of unanswered questions, but, you know, this is the year of all my magical girls in my idol anime, because between this, freaking Aikatsu was coming out with something else, so, you know, your girl is happy. Your girl is thriving right now. I'm just, like, the nines. I'm just, it's everything I wanted, and I love it so much. So, I'm just so happy that this is just happening, and I honestly just, like can't wait and just between other things especially like okay i'll, I'll share one more thing infinity nikki <laughs> from state of play is such so i get my other magical girl ask <laughs> yay so whatever the hell that's coming out but the sad thing is waiting i don't like to wait i i'm not i'm, I'm a very impatient person i truly am hence for an example this is the last thing i'm gonna talk about before we end the video um, so, mind you, you can't, you see the box in the background. Okay. So, I just recently, it was third Wednesday, Thursday, I bought a skin, um, for my PlayStation. I, got, I saw this cute little skin of Kirby, and I was like, oh my god, I want it. Came yesterday, found out it was bent, and it ruined my whole night. So I was like, all right, I'm going back to work on Sunday. I'll just take it back. So we come to today, this afternoon, and I said, okay, I'll just go ahead and buy face plates. And, and I found pink ones because I'm obsessed with fucking pink and such because I'm a girl at top. So, um, mind you, getting those fucking face plates off of the PlayStation are a bitch. 
So I had to have extra help. But now I have pink face plates, and now it's on my PlayStation. So, yeah. Happy day for the even once again. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 18 or episode 1000 of the entirety of Pretty Hair. Really, once again, a wonderful Pretty Hair button. <laughs> If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join my special squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for episode 19, where we finally get to complete this group until our final, final cure. Unless Mayu is our final, final cure. But, you know, we're just going to put a pause on that. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.